fun projects. I feel like that's what I've been missing this whole time. I've got quite a lot to do in this next week. Busy week, lots of things to do. I've just been kind of pottering around the house. That can go in my bag of bags. I had something different. Good afternoon everyone. So it is Saturday the 11th of September and it's actually dead on four now in the afternoon. Yes. So welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. My name is Chloe and I am a writer and a musician here on YouTube and today I thought I would do kind of like a weekend in the life but I don't know how many days I'm actually going to film, how much I'm really going to vlog. I just really wanted to pick up the camera. But then again, I don't want to burn myself out too much because I don't really know. I just keep getting the urge to vlog. And so I, I just thought, you know, I'd pick up the camera, even though I literally only have one bar of battery. But ooh, maybe I'll charge my camera when I'm on my walk. Yes, it's four in the afternoon. What have I been doing today? I woke up fairly early for me this morning at like half eight. Got up because my alarm was going off. That's when I set it for half eight. My cat had knocked a lot of things off of my bedside cabinet, including my phone. Do you see that crack in the corner there? I don't think you can. See that crack in the corner where my thumb is there? Yeah, um, and then there were little cracks through the protector as well. Luckily, it's just the protector and not my actual phone because I would have been fuming if I didn't have a screen protector on. But today I've just been, well this morning, I've obviously done my usual morning routine and I've just been doing some YouTube stuff this morning. I do have some editing to do. To be honest, I don't think it really matters when I do it. But I have actually been shopping and so I wanted to show you the bits that I bought. Right, and yes, the things I did buy were from Home Bargains. And no, none of this is in order. So the first thing is Mentos Tropical Chewing Gum. I've then just got some sanitary pads. Pretty basic. Every woman needs them. Or, you know, everyone who has... A vagina sanitary pads for every vaginal need I have a face fax nighttime sheet mask because I wanted to, I wanted to try some more of this I've never tried this before so you know just thought I would pick it up to try it I've got a bottle of Lucasade sport orange because I like the stuff I was gonna pick up Rubicon but I was rushing around the shop so I just and I was closer to the refrigerator drink so I just picked this up. I've got some chorizo slices, Spanish chorizo, a five pack of pepperamis. I've then got this Derma V10 lavender roll on. Yes we all know I'm pretty bad at sleep at the moment which I think I'm going to talk about later um, but I just thought I'd pick this up and see if it you know actually works. I think this was like 99p. I then also picked up some simple soothing eye balm. I love anything that goes around my eyes, especially in the morning and at night time because I do my bags, am I right? Newton's Labs T-Zone Skincare Charcoal Nose Pore Strips and there are just six in there. I love these so much. I use them like once a week. Oh, Cherry Carmex. And this is actually SPF 15. I do already have an unopened one, like still in the box in like my stock up because I'm just that type of person that likes to stock up a lot. I've then just got some of this face facts overnight face mist. Nighttime sheet mask was 69p. Trizzo slices 69p. Overnight mist 129. I've then also got the overnight face serum in the same packaging it's just so cute isn't it 149 i've then literally just got three of these splendid syrups the toffee caramel flavor because i love these so much in my coffee it's just the best and three of them yes and they're like 99p which is why 
I got three. Oh, I then also just picked up these skinny mint and dark chocolate snack bars. They're not for me. But I just decided to pick some up for my boyfriend's mum because she absolutely loves these. So I thought I would get her some. And I think they were like 99p each because they usually are. And I then just decided to pick up something for my boyfriend's sister. I just got her this Galaxy Smooth Milk Bar and hopefully she likes it because she's about the same age as my brother, who is 15? Yeah, 15. <laughs> and then I just got my boyfriend this Cadbury Dairy Milk Oreo Bar because I know how much he loves this chocolate. I also like it. And the Galaxy was 149 oreo bar was 99p and i've then just got some more makeup remover because i love this stuff this is the garnier skin active micellar cleansing water i believe this is actually like 3.99 no 4.99 sorry i've then got two boxes of the bliss uh chocolate orange whip bars 99p i think yeah 99p and then white chocolate and lemon flavor i love these i love a lot of these kind of bars also 99p each sugar coated pear drops because i just like having something like this to hand not exactly good for me i'm aware but i just like having something like this to um this is gonna sound weird but suck on oh, my boyfriend is laughing his head off right now I'm in such a weird mood, I'm incredibly sorry. I then just decided to pick up a Sensodyne Daily Care Soft toothbrush. I probably shouldn't have picked up soft, but I don't care. It's literally just for when my <laughs> electric toothbrush runs out of charge and I just need something else to brush my teeth with because I hate having, I just hate that feeling of having a dirty mouth. And then I've just got L'Oreal Alvive Color Protect Shampoo and conditioner the the smaller bottles because they didn't have any bigger ones and they're both just 250 milliliters or mil however you say it and these were both just 199 each yeah i literally have prices of things memorized at this point oh no and then i just got a packet of skips so cheap i think like 99p or something and that is everything that i got It is now half nine and I have now cleaned my bed off. Actually, I think the last time I actually vlogged was before I went on my walk. I've done a lot since then. I've obviously been on my walk. I have actually phoned my nan and I've had dinner. And I don't really know what I've done with myself like the last couple of hours. I just feel like time keeps flying by and I can't keep up but now I was gonna say that I want to get some like writing done but it's not really writing at the moment I'm just obviously taking a big break from my big projects well my only big project Scarlet Blood Skies and I am just working on fun projects projects that I don't think I would ever publish but I think that is what I need um and I just I just want it to be fun I feel like that's what I've been missing this whole time just writing being fun and it's just it's felt like a chore but with these new ideas that I've got I actually like want to work on them i do really need to plan out the next week because it's completely bare but then again i do really want to work on my fun project like i said so i'm a little bit torn I'm not entirely sure what to do so maybe i'll do a bit of planning and then some writing
morning everyone so it is now sunday the 12th of september and it's currently about 20 to 12 it is actually such a nice day today and i don't know what it is i'm just feeling like really good i don't know why but, like i'm excited and like i've got that like that anxious feeling but it's not like anxiety it's like it's probably like a mixture of anxiety and excitement because I feel like they're just they're quite similar aren't they you know you get like the same sort of like bodily symptoms <laughs> like the heart pounding and I don't know what it is but it's a nice sunny like day today or it was anyway and like the sky was clear not so much now but it's still nice and sunny i actually think this vlog is going to be more like a week in the life instead of like a weekend because i actually have quite a lot to do in the next few days i've literally got a video to edit for saturday because i will not be here to edit on friday i should be able to get it done i don't know why i'm thinking i won't i've got quite a lot to do in this next week and so i just kind of want to document it and yes i'm about to go for my shower but first i think i'm actually going to go on the driving app Thank you. 
one of the weirdest angles I have ever used. I'm just kind of struggling with this current edit, this current video edit. I don't really know why. Actually, I do. There's just a lot to it and it needs to be done by Thursday at the latest, the edit. I need to crack on with this edit and I need to be like setting myself small goals along the way because setting big goals like editing an entire video is incredibly overwhelming. What are you doing? Hmm? What? afternoon everyone it's now monday the 13th of september it's currently 20 past 12 as you can see i've actually been up for a fairly long time i woke up at nine and i've literally just been getting ready doing my morning routine and when i say morning routine i <laughs> still have yet to actually film that i think it's planned for the next quarter i'm not sure but yes i would love to film like an actual morning routine video yeah it takes me long to get ready when i have to like straighten my hair because yeah i did straighten my hair because i do have work this evening which means i really don't have long to get things done today i have already like completed a few things on my to-do list so i think i might take them off so I have obviously had my breakfast and I've journaled and I've been on the driving app and then this is the main thing I need to do today just editing that because I really oh I thought that I wanted to add the music today but since it's on Tuesday I don't need to worry about that I just need to finish the trim edit today that's just the main thing and then these extra things on here like obviously the vacuuming i really need to do but these two here are kind of optional this week i also need to prepare to go to my boyfriend's thursday evening after work and then i have my second vaccine on friday so busy week 
lots of things to do to be able to, you know, have everything ready before I go to my boyfriend's. I do think I'm going to end up starting to pack on Wednesday. Wednesday I'll also need to shower and everything like that because obviously I'll have work on Wednesday, I'll have work again tomorrow evening and then Wednesday and Thursday. It's just such a busy week and I'm actually quite hungry. <laughs> That's not surprising though, I'm always hungry. And yes, I need to have my week in the life all ready to go Thursday at the latest. I think I've already said something like that. So, so far today I was asleep at 8am because I said I woke up at 9, I woke up and got up, got ready, got ready, I then had breakfast at half 10. I honestly just don't know how well you can actually see this. And then at 11am I journaled slash went on driving app, went on driving app slash straightened hair and then straighten hair slash I'm just gonna put vlogging in there but now <laughs> I, I really need to just crack on with this edit Top that eclipsed the room. I was the one who arrived too soon. But no one would ever bet against us. If they saw us exchanging glances, I was too busy to fall in love. You were too busy to break my heart. Nobody else was there to stop us. Nobody else is there to want us Now we go on and on with this poor love song We've been working on far too long, baby Do you still remember when our hearts turned up spontaneously? On and on like a marathon We keep running from fighting for something Something to remind us that we're better than this poor love song Too busy watching the TV screen Now we're just betting on broken dreams Nobody's gonna come and save us We cash in too many empty favors
Good afternoon, everyone. So, yes, it's now Tuesday the 14th, and I said good afternoon because it is indeed the afternoon. It's currently 25 to 1, and this Saturday's video is currently exporting, so the one I was cranking out the edit of yesterday and so basically while that's been exporting i've just been kind of pottering around the house so while my video has been exporting i've just kind of been pottering around the house which i'm not used to doing i also did my morning routine so journaling and going on the driving app and then i had to supervise my 15 year old brother whilst he did the dishwasher but I'm not gonna go into that. Today, I'm actually going to start sorting out my bag for when I go to my boyfriend's Thursday night after work because this is the current state of the bag that I will be taking. Yes, I'm literally going to be using my old college bag because it's got lots of space, but I do have shit in it that doesn't really need to be in there. You know, things like, what the fuck is that? Clothes and, oh, glasses, glasses case which um, is full of glasses that I'm wearing right now. What else have I got in here? I've got a pencil case, which literally just has highlighters in because I just don't know where else to put them. And like I said, I've got clothes in here, fucking pens in here. Just don't know where else to put them. Like seriously, I know I not long did a declutter of my entire room. I feel like I really didn't do that much. I literally did my books, my wardrobe, my bedside cabinet. And I feel like that's pretty much it. And then I've got things like shopping bags in here. Like this is a fucking Christmas bag, like a home bargains Christmas bag. That can go in my bag of bags. Don't tell me I'm crazy because I know I am already. I've also got hand cream in here. And while I like it, I've had this for fucking ages, but it's old, very old. So I just needs to go because I've got two others here already i've also just got shit in here that i'm going to be taking to my boyfriend's anyway bits for his family but then i also have folders in here which though i'd love to keep them in there not ideal but there's nowhere else to put them literally nowhere else because i've literally been using this very bag as folder storage because my top shelf where I would usually keep my folders it's full but I've got things like notebooks in here that I have not used whatsoever but then I've got another one in here that's actually college work but this usually keeps my bag quite steady and straight so I will probably just keep this in my bag ah yes we have been blessed with more folders do you see my issue? I think you do. And I think they're literally all college folders as well. Yep, just a bunch of college things. I don't go to college anymore. And to be fair, I should probably just recycle all the paper because it's not good. I have lots of shitting paper. Maybe I'll do like a whole separate video of me decluttering all of the paper that I've got because it's kind of ridiculous. Ooh, I think I might actually have a use for this now. This is literally my hard drive thingy my bob for like transporting, moving around a hard drive, external hard drive. So I might actually keep this because I might take it with me, but that will be something that I'll have to pack on Thursday. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just gonna try and pack what I can. Oh my fucking god. 
I just found more hand sanitizer. Like, what the fuck? But that's disgusting. afternoon everyone so it is now wednesday the 15th of september it is about 25 past one it is a wednesday and i've been working for the past two evenings and i'm usually someone that showers in the evenings but because i work evenings Monday to Thursday, it does mean that I have to start showering Wednesday mornings, so my Wednesdays tend to be a bit more relaxed and not so much pressure, which is why it's now the afternoon because I woke up at I think about 20 past 8. And if you're wondering, why I'm so out of breath. I just got my super drug order delivered. I ran down the stairs, realised there was no key in the back of the door, which, you know, there were usually keys in the back of the door. Ran back up to grab my keys, ran back down, only to realise that the door was already unlocked. <laughs> I just wanted to kind of show you the things that I got. It's just basics, really. It's really not much. I literally just have th three four in shower moisturizers the nivea body moisturizer in shower nourishing with for like dry skin i've got four because i like to just stock up and it just kind of makes it easier i've got the vitamin e skincare sugar and oil body scrub this stuff is actually quite good and my sister uses it as well last time i did a super drug order i bought body scrubs that I kind of used and didn't really like so I'm just gonna stick with this once I finish them up and I've then just got the vitamin E nourishing eye cream because I don't know what it is but I've definitely started getting back in like well back into I've definitely started to like get into eye creams now and like anything that goes under my eyes because i feel like i'm either well i'm always tired anyway so i'm always you know trying to find products that make my under eye bags look less puffy and more brightening i'm pretty much stocked up on like eye creams and eye gels and everything like that speaking of eye products i've just got these eye sheet masks from Garnier Skin Active and I've got the Moisture Bomb Nighttime one eye tissue mask and then this Moisture Bomb eye sheet mask and then this just came free with my order which is literally just I want to say me moisturizing hyaluronic sheet mask 
Uh, today I don't really have like any big tasks to do. I would say I'm done editing but I do need to start thinking about editing next Wednesday's video which is just a Friday day in the life vlog. <laughs> Either that or I work on my fun writing project nothing but everything to hide which i have yet to kind of talk about it's part of my like, september writing vlog but yesterday before work i forgot to mention that i was actually looking over my schedule for the next quarter and i just wasn't liking how it looked because i had it planned so my hiatus would go from the end of October to the end of November and I really wanted to plan my hiatus for like October more than November so yesterday I just moved around a few things to bring like my hiatus forward yes I will be going on a hiatus but I have yet to like announce any like dates or anything like that it was just it was kind of getting me down last night not even last night but yesterday so that's why I just changed things around so things are gonna be different moving forward and yes today is gonna be the last day of this vlog and trying to pack more for going to my boyfriend's I think I'm actually gonna get lunch because I'm quite hungry and I had breakfast at like half nine. morning everyone so it is now thursday the 16th and it's currently 10 past 11 and that's unusual for me for my day to start early but i've got a lot of things to do today and i barely vlogged yesterday just because i feel like i barely did anything yesterday because it was a no pressure day when really i should have been getting things done but i seriously need to finish packing my bag to go to my boyfriend's there are just a lot of things that I couldn't pack before because they're more like daily items so I need to pack them today but the other issue I'm facing is that I don't have a toiletries bag the only toiletries bag that I have readily available is my makeup bag and I'm not about to tip all of my makeup products out of it just to use it for my toiletries to take to my boyfriends so I have no clue what I'm going to do without like a wash bag and then I also need to wash up and I need to clean the bathroom I just need to get on with it I think but I didn't vlog much yesterday just because I ended up working on brainstorming for my new writing fun project, fun writing project, when really I should have been editing next Wednesday's video. So I have to do that today, along with everything else. So I'm gonna have a busy day <laughs> today. That's why I just need to get on with it. Would you hold me tight? 
and now that I have done all of my house chores for the day which is actually surprising because it's like 20 past 12 I really need to finish packing and I found a wash bag like a toiletries bag however it is my boyfriend's because he just left it here so yeah I'm just gonna use this because I don't want to just be chucking all of my toiletries in willy nitty willy nilly because i just don't want any explosions but now there is so much to say this time it is different sometimes i can understand how we can be so hard to stay out of pain but with you everything has changed even though we both stay the same I have now packed everything that I can possibly think of but there are gonna be bits in my handbag because obviously I'll be going straight to my boyfriend's after work I'll need this for work I should probably do a bit of a check of this to make sure that I've got everything in here that I need this is actually kind of disgusting I do have paracetamol in here Oh, the one thing I really need to remember is my hairbrush, but I will be like brushing my hair later before I go to work. So I just need to remember to put that in the bag, most likely in the back. So I'll have to put my hairbrush in later on before I take my bag downstairs. I think this bag is all right and then I've also got my sunflower lanyard which I'm going to need for tomorrow because I'm getting my second vaccine. I now need to actually do some editing and one of the other things that I kind of completely forgot about is planning out next week so I'm gonna have to like go over my outline with pen today and then start writing out my goals for the week and everything like that and then I can do the rest when I get back from my boyfriend's and this is the current state oh this is wonky and this is the current state of next Wednesday's video And it is now about 20 past three. I have just had my lunch. I had a nice tuna and sweet corn sandwich, which is a bit different for me because there wasn't enough lettuce for a feta bacon and lettuce wrap. So I had something different, which isn't like me. And I have about an hour until I need to, you know, get dressed and everything ready for work and literally in that time all I'm really gonna do is maybe try and get some more editing done of my Friday in the life that goes up next Wednesday also start planning out next week but this vlog has been really long and I apologize because obviously at the moment I don't know how long it's actually gonna be I'm I'm just <laughs> apologizing in advance for how long this is but this is gonna be the end of this vlog I really hope you enjoyed it if you did make sure to give it a big thumbs up also make sure to subscribe down below and ding the bell to be notified for every single time I upload all of my social media links will also be down in the description for you to check out if you so wish to and I feel like I've got a lot done in a very short period of time but that is gonna be everything thank you so much for watching 
and I will see you in my next video. Bye!